What's up guys, welcome to day three of the vlog. If you haven't seen the first two vlogs, I played the main event three times, so you can check those out on the channel if you want. Today we have a very exciting day, it's gonna be mystery bounty time. I've never played a mystery bounty before live in my life. Um, it's gonna be a whole new concept to me. The bounties come into play when you're in the money, and then when you win a bounty, you can actually pull some sort of a lottery ticket that says how big the bounty actually is. There's some huge ones in there, so we're hoping to win a jackpot. I have a few strategy questions that I'm not entirely sure about, so I'm gonna try and find a friend uh, who can answer those, but but uh, other than that, I'm excited to play again, so let's fucking go. E-E-L-D. E-E-L-D. H-U-I. I don't know how to spell it, I just don't know how to say it. H-U-I. House. Yeah, house. 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 Yeah, it means the same thing oh, yeah, in Dutch. Yeah, yeah. House. Yeah. Nice. Yeah, so All right, Mystery Bounty time, let's fucking go. I don't know if you have a favorite one. Uh, I'll take the seven of diamonds. That is it, you see? So I'll, I'll put Lex here. <laughs> All right. So everybody knows what the hell we're doing. Thank you very much, sir. All right, yeah, of Lex. course. Yeah, thanks. It's always embarrassing. Ugliest signature in the whole world. Looks like a toddler. Like gener generally, generally, generally. How yes. often do I forget stuff? Oh, I'm pretty worries. organized. Yeah, you are super organized. Okay, thank you. We had to turn the camera on for that one. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> super organized. <laughs> Is the button like, does he look like somebody who plays tournaments a lot? Yeah, he's excellent. Yeah, then I would just go on. Yeah. yeah. That what uh, you did? Yeah. Good? Now I'm here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but you did it in the good way, you he know? He tanked on Ace King. Oh. All, All right. right. Well, yeah. I really loved your vlog. Nice, thanks. Yeah, we played on the first day. Yeah, 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 we did. Yeah, you were right across from me. Yeah, yeah. I know. Yeah. All right. All right. All right, take care, David. Let's go find, uh, I need some bounty advice. Let's see if we can find Sam Grafton. What's up, superstar? I did three times. <laughs> What, that's it? Yeah. The wife cut you off? Responsible gambling, they cut you off? By the way, look at this for the vlog. I got to stand on the step and now yeah. we're in... You know, I'm like Tom Cruise when he's working yeah. the Nicole Kidman here. I'm on the step. Finally, I'm on your level. Yeah. How's things? What are you in? Yeah, good. No, I'm going to play Mystery Bounty. Ah, nice. Is there um, any wisdom? Is there... Because I was thinking, right? Because maybe I'm going way too deep in this, but I was thinking, if you're in the money and is it worth it to keep short stacks alive on the bubble on your yeah, table? Yeah, of course. Of course, you don't. Like sometimes people call someone's all in like five minutes before the bounty starts for three binks. It's like, yeah, give him the blind and let him survive. Yeah, 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 okay, okay, okay. But I mean, basically, if you just work out what a bounty's worth, you're like top 5% of the field straight away. Loads of people don't don't calculate the chip value of the bounty. Yeah, basically. okay, okay. But And then do you, do you do that knowing which bounties are still in? I mean, well, you have to, Unfortunately, I, guess. I never run deep enough to start recalculating. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Obviously, at some point, you should start to recalculate. Right? Yeah, okay. So it's continually dynamic. But he didn't make, you know, like fourth level of the last tournament as if he needs to start worrying. Like in the, on the final table bubble, should I be doing this? I'm like, let's get, let's wait, let's wait till we get there, Lex. No, no. Yeah. I got it. I got a good feeling about this one. Great yeah. to see you, bro. You too. Yeah. Good luck. Whoa! <laughs> what the fuck happened there? <laughs> it was really nice to meet you. Hello, sir. <laughs> Return to the land of the hobbits. <laughs> Make it four. Two is the big one. Raise 900. We both made a mistake. You made it three, I made it nine by accident, yeah. It's not good. <laughs> it's early. The 3000 mystery bounty just started. I have a really nice looking table. Friendly people, and more importantly, not too many names that ring a bell. Now, of course, that doesn't mean much, as white t-shirt guy from the first vlog ended up being an, a solid American circuit rack. Anyway, I get ace five of clubs in the hijack. I make it 500 in 100, 200 with a 200 ante. Button calls. Up to the small blind, who raised to 12 big blinds earlier from under the gun one orbit earlier. Let's call him Bob. Bob makes a 1200 from the small blind. Very tiny raise. I decide to just call in the button calls as well. Flop is ace jack deuce. The small blind bets 2400. It's a pretty large bet, but I'm clearly not going anywhere. I have a backdoor flush draw as well as a backdoor straight draw. The button folds. Turn is an eight, second heart. He bets 2400 again. Now this is interesting. I have zero info and based on the earlier hand, he could be a blaster. He looks like he could be a blaster and that's a compliment. Now the bet is relatively small as there's almost 9K in the pot. I call. River's a deuce of hearts, completing a possible flush, and he bets 3600. It's a great card for me because now I chop versus hands as high as ace 10, 
there's no way he has a back to flush throw with this bedding pattern as well. Even so, this is super uncomfortable. I'm either getting milked like a cow or someone is deploying the I'm gonna bluff and making it look like a value bet strategy that never works. The conversation with Sam Grafton is going through my head. Are these the spots we stay out of? Is this just not what we're looking for when we're trying to make money in live tournaments? But the fact I know zero about him, the fact that he could be a blaster, and the fact that I get ridiculous odds to call makes me call. He turns over Ace Queen of Diamonds. Great. Not a blaster then. He played his hand pretty honestly and took me on a one way trip to Value Town, down the half stack. Nice, nice. How nice. are you doing? Good, nice level. All right, uh, not bad. Mystery on 75 minutes in the round. Once again, players in the mystery on 75 minutes in the round. Nice, I didn't know about that one. You know, could have been a good, could have been a good dad. Message my family, say like, hey, I have a 75 minute dinner break. But there was no dinner break in the main event, so I didn't know. But anyway, I'm gonna go over to see them now. But I uh, had a really good level. I uh, after that one big pot that I lost at the start. Um, after that, I was down to 13 big blinds, and I made uh, uh, I defended six three of hearts in the big blinds, made a flush, uh, was up to 10k again, which was 30 big blinds, um, and then I made a straight with nines on. 8, 10, Jack, Queen against a set of Jacks. Uh, so then I had 20k again, and then I had a lot of pots that just went the right way, was able to steal some pots, make some hands, and I'm up to 38,000 now from 30k starting. So really nice, happy. Uh, time to have a nice dinner break, then play uh, four more hours, I believe. Yeah, four more hours, and uh, yeah, let's go. Feeling good? Now you're not even gonna walk towards me. Now you're gonna walk towards Brandon, the cameraman, just to wait for me when I'm going on I break. I was pulled over, I was out the door. These guys pulled me in and they're like, look, we need, Pure lies. We need viewership, we need numbers, we're looking at metrics, we got one I big, saw you in the comments got too, got you big, fucking scum. Yeah, I was in a great, it was a little, nice little comment tied I in with the you. team of the video. Uh, please subscribe, please subscribe to Lex House right here on YouTube. Thank you. See? That's a powerful call to action. That's a huge call to action. Please subscribe to Lex, thank you. He needs it, we need it, thank you. Anything for you, buddy? Anything for you, my friend? Are you playing? Yeah, I have uh, 80. 80? 80. 80. Are you, how about you? Let's see. Yeah? Yeah, I, I just bought in and then I went down to 14k and then I just stopped up twice. And wow, easy just game. hangover yeah. style. I had a drink last time. I'd had a drink <laughs> last time. He tried, he tried. He wanted to book a bet that he could become the Prime Minister of England. <laughs> yeah, which I genuinely, I, I stand by that this morning. So I think he's good. I don't think it can be that hard, can it? I think it started off that I would become a member of Parliament. And then I think that's pretty easy. Prime Minister is a little tougher. But I just don't have the time, you know? Playing Mystery Bounty 3K, stuff to do. Successful stuff. content creator. I got a YouTube channel to run over at Spraggy TV oh. on YouTube. Fuck off. <laughs> Guys, thank you so much for watching. This is the end of the vlog. Stay tuned for part two tomorrow.